Good Monday morning, people. <sighs> Going to get back on the CUDA, get the hydraulics bled and working, and this way we can do the top. Um, as soon as um, Dave gets here, uh, this week we will do the, um, the carburetor adjustment the way he was talking about. Um, and I think what we'll do is we'll definitely um, videotape that. This way we have it for you guys to see how it's done on a dual carburetor system. Then I'm getting back on that puppy. I'm going to put the intake on and probably the starter and all that stuff. And um, going to do a compression test so we see where we're up to. Once that's all done, let's turn it around. We're going to be soaking those, getting that all cleaned up, getting all that cleaned up. And we're going to put that motor back together. I think I'm going to put that in the Plymouth just so I have a general motor in there. And then down the road, if I find a 440, I will change it. Okay, guys, let's get going. All right, we got the top bled and all the cylinders are in, the motor is in. Um, we're just gonna jump the motor and make sure that the top goes up and down. works. Now I'm going to mount the motor and tuck in all the lines and take a look at the mechanism and see why the mechanism is folding in the middle a little bit. But all in all, it works. All right. Now that we've got the top working in there and everything tucked in we're going to tweak the motor and start assembling everything also got the motor together I'm going to um, do a compression test on it make sure I've got compression put some plugs in it carburetor and a distributor and fire this puppy up then we can see just where we are all right, guys, like and subscribe and tell people about the channel. Let's see if we can get this channel to go a little bit bigger. You guys have a good day.